purity, is the power which our prophets have revealed to us. The purification of body, strengthens our soul. Purity, is the basic part of Islam. This is, why Islam has put so much emphasis on being clean. Every Muslim in the world makes ablution, before offering prayers. After about 1400 years, the pattern of washing the body parts has become an amazing experiment for scientists all around the globe. Most of the Muslims, are not aware that, ablution is a medical safeguard they are applying on their body. refreshes your body. The Prophet, peace be upon him, has suggested making ablution before going to bed. Washing of hands, arms, mouth, eyes, and legs, with fresh water. It helps relaxing sleep, that are also suggested by the yoga experts now. Refluxotherapy. Ablution stimulates biological rhythms of your body and certainly biological active sport spaces. Usually, similar things applies in Chinese refluxotherapy. Washing nose during ablution helps in prevention from microbic diseases. It is confirmed after a microscopic investigation, the nose of those who do not perform ablution, was exposed to a lot of lethal microbes, which can cause many diseases. Washing arms helps in blood circulation. It is also established that, blood circulation at the limbs is weaker. Because, they are far from the center of the blood pumping heart. Furthermore, their activity of washing during this process improves the blood circulation, making the person feel less depressed. Washing hands prevents from pneumonia. Washing of hands also reduces infections respiratory, by removing infectious to be found on the hands. Mouth rinsing prevents systematic diseases. During ablution, we wash our hands and rinse our face. As well as, we rinse our mouth with clean water. So, when we rinse our mouth in order to remove food particles and bacteria from the mouth, 